TFNN Headline News Update. Here's Tom O'Brien. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien, coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 10 a.m. Eastern Time on Tuesday, 30 minutes into the trading day, and we got markets sitting in negative territory. S&P is just going negative by one point, trading at 28.66. We've got the NASDAQ off 14 points, or about two-tenths percent, trading at 78. 14 and the Dow off 46 points or about two tenths percent as well, trading at 26,212. We'll start things off this morning getting a little bit of negative action after the open in the market and the VIX hanging down 1360. Was it 1350 when we opened? So up about 10 pennies. Jumping over to the futures markets. Excuse me, we'll start it off with the Dow 30. So there's your escalation to the downside, really beginning at about 8.20 this morning. There's your opening bell bar at 9.30. We trade from 26.225 to 26.171, currently sitting right in the middle of that first bar, 26,191 in the Dow. NASDAQ 100, a little bit of a different story, selling off a bit just from where we were at about 8 a.m. this morning, 75.11. We're now about 22 points from that level, trading at 74.88. S&P's much the same, volatility, 10 a.m. bar, trading at 26.68. Highs this morning, excuse me, 28.68 is where we're trading. Highs this morning, 28.73. Gold contract, we were above 1,300 yesterday. That's about 24 hours ago at 9 a.m. Eastern Time on Monday. From there, we are trading a bit higher, but we made lows at around 12.90. Gold trading 12.94.63. And how about crude oil? There it is. Crude oil, volatility for sure. We peak above $62 at about 6.30 this morning. We trade all the way back down to about 61.60. And from there, we take off again. You got crude trading at highs of 62.26. In terms of what else you have happening in the market, Walgreens with their earnings this morning, market not liking what they had to say, and they should not like that in terms of the big number. Company now expects full year earnings for 2019 to be roughly flat compared with its previous forecast of 7 to 12 percent growth. That is quite a haircut on your earnings, saying we're going to grow at maybe double digits and it comes in flat and as you would expect Walgreens down almost 13 percent trading down eight dollars at 55.42 and to keep up with the story Lyft getting a lift at the open back above 70 dollars the opening price on Lyft though 72 where that was priced at we'll see if Lyft can stay in the positive for today stay tuned come back at 10 o'clock with Tom live programming all day at TFNN have a great Tuesday everybody